love. You doing okay? Why are you over here on the floor? Trying to get some rest. I get it. Sometimes we just need to spread out and relax. That's okay. Well, would you like some tea? Maybe a story? Help you kind of fall asleep? I have your favorite mug. And your favorite tea. Yeah, this is the pomegranate and white tea. You like that one, right? And I happen to have some hot water. So let's put this right. Oops, we don't want the tag in there. Okay. And some water. right up here on the table for you so it can cool down a little bit. How about a candle and then I'll read a story? Okay. I have the Woodwick one. I think this is the kind of like a bourbon vanilla. Do you like it? Okay. Get the lighter. This is going to make you feel nice and cozy. on the table for you and what about commotion in the ocean do you remember this book let's read it I'm going to sit up a little bit. Okay. Oh, sorry. I'll read it, and then I'll show you the pictures, okay? Okay. Commotion in the ocean. There's a curious commotion at the bottom of the ocean. I think we ought to go and take a look. You'll find every sort of creature that lives beneath the sea swimming through the pages of this book. There are dolphins, whales, and penguins. There are jellyfish and sharks. There's the turtle and the big white polar bear. But can you see behind the wrecks and in between the rocks? Let's take a look and find who's hiding there. <laughs> crab. The crab likes walking sideways and I think the reason why 
is to make himself look sneaky and pretend that he's a spy. Turtles, we crawl up the beach from the water to bury our eggs on dry land. We lay a whole batch and then when they hatch, they scamper about the sand. Dolphins. The wonderful thing about dolphins is hearing them trying to speak. It's not, how do you do? As I'd say to you, it's more of a click, whistle, squeak. Angelfish. Hello, I'm the angelfish, darling the prettiest thing in the sea. What a shame there are no other creatures as gorgeous and lovely as me. Jellyfish. The jellyfish just loves to jiggle, which other fish thinks is quite dumb. She knows that it's not all that useful, but jiggling, lots of good fun. swim with a grin up to greet you. See how my jaws open wide? Why don't you come a bit closer? Please take a good look inside. Swordfish. I love to chase after small fishes. It keeps me from getting too bored. And then when I start feeling hungry, I skewer a few on my sword. Octopus. Having eight arms can be useful. You may think it looks a bit funny, but it helps me to hold all my children and tickle each one on the tummy. Stingray. At the bottom of the ocean, the stingray flaps his wings, but don't you get too close to him. His tail really stings. Lobster. Never shake hands with a lobster. It isn't a wise thing to do. With a clippity clap and a snippity snap, he would snip all your fingers in two. deep sea, miles below the surface, where the water's dark and deep, lives the most amazing creatures that you could ever meet. There are fish of all descriptions of every shape and size. Some have giant pointy teeth and great big bulging eyes. Some of them can walk around and balance on their fins, but the strangest fish of all have glowing whiskers on their chins. We can finish this later.